Hello, welcome to the video. First of all, my name is Said Rahimi Faris and my partner is Muhammad Sufri. Today, we are going to talk about green computing. I'm pretty sure you guys have heard about green computing, but did you guys really know what it means? In this video, we are going to show you what green computing is. Green computing is the environmentally responsible and eco-friendly use of computers and their resources. In broader terms, it is also defined as the study of designing, engineering, manufacturing, using, and disposing of computing devices in a way that reduces their environmental impact. So here are ways to green computing. The first one is to buy energy efficient notebook computers instead of desktop computers. This is because notebook computers usually consume less energy rather than desktop computers. It is important to avoid waste of energy. The second one is, instead of purchasing a new computer, try refurbishing an existing device. By refurbishing, it reduces electronic waste, toxins, and the demand for natural resources. It also prevents more manufacturing, which will create environmentally harmful products. The third one is, turn off computers at end of each day. It is important to avoid waste of energy. Shutting down co your computer also allows it to run faster with a clear RAM. So here is the advantages and disadvantages when we using green computing that is very crucial in our daily life. So first of all, we need to know what is those are the advantages that we need to know. So first of all, green computing can help you save money on electricity that is very crucial nowadays. Next, in the long term, green computing can save money also. So next is customer health hazards are reduced as the push to go green in the IT industry grow. The fourth one is working circumstances that are better than other because green computing will make the working uh air, the working environment is more better. The last one is beneficial effects on our flora and fauna because we need to save our flora and fauna so that the layer also will not thin. And also, we as a human will get a fresh air. So in this part, we'll talk about the disadvantages when we using the green computing. So the first disadvantage is plenty of knowledge may be required. This is because not many people know how to use the green computing and uh, knowledge about it. The second one is may slow down the computer network. It's shown that the computer will be slowed down when using the network. The third one is technological change may make all the IT system obsolete. The older IT system will cannot be used anymore when using the green computing. So for the fourth one is green IT may conflict with profit maximization goals. Not many goals will be maximized and achieved. For the last one is acceptance inside companies may be read lower because of the green computing that keep you uh, updated. That's all from us about the green computing. Thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe. Below is our social media.